Welcome back to K Plus channel. Hello, hello guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe, like this video, and share this video with all your family, friends, colleagues, neighbors, and associates. Thank you. Mary Beth Thune. Mary Beth Thune was born July the 10th, 1875 in Maysville, South Carolina. Bethune was the 15th out of 17 children who took an early interest in becoming educated. She attended seminary college in North Carolina and the Moody Bible Institute in Chicago. Bethune hoped to become a missionary in Africa but failed to get the job. In 1895, she first moved to Georgia and then to Florida to teach. Mary Bethune started the School for African American Girls in Daytona Beach, Florida. The school later merged with a private institute for African American boys and was known as the Bethune Cookman School. She was president of the college from 1923 to 1942 and in 1946 to 1947. She was one of the few women in the world to serve as college, as a college president at that time. By 1935, she was established. By 1935, she had established the NCNW. National Council of Negro Women, which is an umbrella organization that grew to include 22 national groups with a strong presence in Washington. Bethune was a member of the Black Cabinet, which was a group that advised President Roosevelt on issues important to African Americans. She wrote, in 1938 if our people are to fight their way up out of bondage we must arm them with the sword and the shield and buckler of pride belief in themselves and their possibilities based upon a sure knowledge of the achievements of the past a year later she wrote not only the Negro child but children of all races should read and know of the achievements accomplishments and deeds of the Negro. World peace and brotherhood are based on a common understanding of the contributions and cultures of all races and creeds. A year later she wrote, not only the Negro child but children of all races should read and know of the achievements, accomplishments and deeds of the Negro. World peace and brotherhood are based on a common understanding of the contributions and cultures of all races and creeds. On May 18, 1955, Bethune died of a heart attack. In 1973, Mary Bethune was inducted into the National Women's Hall of Fame, and in 1974, the Mary Bethune Memorial was erected in her honor in Lincoln Park, Washington, D.C.